I'm a football player myself. Probably not the most talented player in the world. I think the past 10 years I've maybe scored two goals. And I think, you know, I would pay anything to watch those two goals again. The past 100 years, the way you have filmed football, filmed sport, right, is that you've got a camera that mechanically follows the action, which requires a cameraman. What if you could actually record the whole scene, meaning that you don't need a cameraman, and then instead let artificial intelligence figure out where would a cameraman actually have filmed? Some of the first things we did was building the deep learning architecture that enables us to track the ball and understand the game so we can automatically drive our virtual camera zooming in on where the action is on the field. In recent years, there has been a revolution in AI research. Around five years ago, the algorithms in this field surpassed human performance. And this is something that was not possible 10 years ago. We use all these recent advances to make a system that can detect the ball and that can track the ball in good enough quality that we're able to follow the action on the football field. I really love the scientific aspect of it. I really love that we can put these models into action and actually allow the customers of Veo to get better features and a better product. Deep learning is all about using neural networks and deep neural networks to process the data. And the data in that case can be anything from text to audio to images to stocks. We use deep learning in VO to track the ball and steer the camera. And what we need to do that is a lot of input data combined with some ground truth, which could be the position of the ball in a certain frame. We collect this data and then we feed it to the model so that the model can on its own find the patterns that are useful for, for example, tracking the ball. I honestly believe we have a big chance to change the world of football. It's primarily the biggest clubs that has a lot of money that uses video to develop talent. And we want to make this possible for everybody. So using technology, we're able to democratize the use of video in sports. We have some of the best researchers in the world working on this product, something we're very proud about. We're not doing research for research. We're doing research because this enables us to deliver a product to our customers. Of course, it's a lot of fun to bring the camera to my own games and record them and come home and look at the highlights and share them with my teammates. Success is when we can see that kids around the world are sharing their moments, when we can see that coaches are developing better talent, that is success for us. When we really show that we are changing something in the sport, making the sport better.